What is he wearing? Is that a necklace or a bow tie? All right, Eric. Where are you coming from? Oh, hold up. But he got Aaron. Wait, where are y'all coming from? You guys try to do the whole opposite direction, leave different interests thing? Huh. Living for the ray of light. Life can be beautiful. Life can be beautiful. Going all the way tonight. Making it beautiful. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. It's me, Lumi Summer, and we are back here with Stacy and our 100 Baby Challenge. And I'm just going to be honest, I did play a little bit offline. Um, we're still in the same day, I think. Um, but I did uh, do a couple of skill building things and got us a little bit of money to do the nursery and kind of moved along the process of her with the baby. So right now she's due to give birth in any minute. So hopefully in this episode she will. And we're just taking having her take a little bit of a nap right now because she's a little exhausted and she may as well get that... Um, get as much rest as she can before the baby gets here also I went ahead and made her family so she has her mom Erica who she's very close with her dad Neil and her baby brother Ryan who's a teenager so yes now she has a little bit of a family to come over and visit actually her mom was just here and she just left we may go to tomorrow to go visit them or invite them over if we have the baby before then and I think we talked about in last episode the next baby daddy was going to be between these two since we have a romance bar with Don we're going to go ahead and have him be our next victim I mean be our next um child's father so yeah so we're just going to have her take a little bit of a nap and I think she actually I think she wants to just go to bed yeah she wants to just sleep so just go ahead and sleep Go ahead and sleep. Maybe she'll go into. Oh no, Vlad. Okay, what? Well, this is what we're not gonna do. Oh good, it's locked. Really? I don't remember locking the door. How did her mom get in? Oh, that's why her mom couldn't get in. Everyone was Stacy. Her mom ended up coming into the back door. Yeah, Vlad. I'm sorry. We're not. You can't come in. Thank you. Bye bye. See you later. Or not ever out we might have Vlad's baby I'm not doing the point system with the baby challenge um, but I know that if you have like an alien baby or a vampire baby they are worth double the points so if you are gonna do this challenge by the book according to the um, point system keep that in mind uh, Vlad hello there I just wanted to welcome you to the community um, my that's a lovely neck you have go away Vlad it's not happening she wants to go to the bathroom again. Oh, and there she is. Anyways, uh, oh, I was hoping she would sleep through until she went into labor, but it doesn't look like she's going to do that because she's hungry. So, we can go ahead and, um, let's go ahead and get the nursery together. Since we are here, all we need right now is a bassinet, which... Yeah, here we go. So I wish there was more room in here for bassinet. Maybe there is. I don't think they'll be able to. Yeah, I don't think that if she has the bassinet here that sh she'll be able to get into the bed on this side. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. I'm going to leave it there because I kind of want the baby in here with her because then she'll wake up when the baby's crying and whatnot. And, um, yeah, but in the meantime, we can put, um, oh, this is cute. This is so cute. Let's, hmm. See, we don't need any of this stuff right now because we don't have a toddler. We don't have a toddler, but we can at least, like, paint the walls, put the nursery colors up for the walls. What do we want to put for the nursery walls? Put on some wallpaper and let's do for the carpet. Yeah, I think I like that. And then um, it doesn't really go with. 
Ooh, that is really busy. That's kind of boring. That's subtle. Is there another one that's like a... I think, I, I think this one. Let's do that. That isn't too bad, huh? Uh, I'm so not good with this when there's people, quote unquote, people watching me, even though no one is here watching me. You guys are not even... You're not here. That's... I like that wallpaper. Let's just change the carpet. Let's change the carpet because I think that's what's throwing off. Where's like the, um, that one carpet that like, is like brick? This. Blocks. This is what I was looking for. It doesn't go with it. I'm just gonna leave it like that. So we'll just do that for now. And I also wanted uh, a laundry. 2,000 and 2,500. Yeek. We can't afford that right now. So do we get the cheapy ones? I guess we have to. Let's get some colorful ones. Ooh, let's go for pink. Do we go for pink? Yeah, we'll just do that there. Pink does not even match. Oh, let's see. Do they have purple? No, of course not. Or we can just be basic and get white. Nice and sleek. Yeah, let's stick with the white. And then we, we're going to need laundry baskets, which my favorite laundry basket is not that one. It's these. And we will just put the laundry basket in the bathroom. Since this is where everyone's going to be changing. And yeah, that's good for now. Right? Yeah. That's good for now. And then whenever we get the baby here, or whenever we have the toddlers, let's turn the lights off in this room, in this room. Yeah, and whenever we get toddlers, then we'll do this bedroom all up and be ready to go. So now, what is she doing? She's literally just waiting for the baby to be born. Hmm. I thought I had played enough offline to get this going. Who's this out here? Oh, that's Eric. I mean, we can try. I think Eric's a floozy, so... I think he's a schmuck, so we can probably um, finesse him all the way out of his marriage, to be honest. <laughs> Convince him to leave his wife and everything. Do we want to do that to Kim? Sure. Why not? Who's that? Uh, God, they walk so fast. They just smash. Advic? Let's meet you too. Let's say hey. Call over. Come over here. Come over here and give a friendly introduction. We can always use as many men's as possible but yeah no i think we can finesse eric all the way out of his marriage to be honest what is he wearing is that a necklace or a bow tie all right eric where are you coming from oh hold up but he got Eric. wait where are y'all coming from you guys try to do the whole opposite direction leave different interests thing Huh. I see you. Look, you guys even got matching shoes. Okay, Eric. I see you. I see you. Hmm. I'm going to have to try and investigate that. As bad as that, he's about to dip out anyways. They're both about to leave. Let's see about the cat we don't have still. <laughs> she so wants a cat. We have to get her a cat. Maybe after the baby's born. If the baby is ever born, swear to goodness. Okay. Well, let's see. We can go visit our our mom. Let's go visit our mom since the baby's not here yet. Um, it's kind of early. We'll go over there like at at like seven. I wonder if she's having twins. Like her parents live back here. So we are going to travel to her mama's house, her mama and dad's house. But um, I wonder if she's having twins because she's really big. Right? Isn't she kind of big? Or is that just me? Is that just me? This house is so ugly. <laughs> so we are going to definitely like put them in a different house. But I just I just made them and moved them. Made them and moved them out. And if you don't know how to do that, pretty much when you're in CAS, there's the little option down here next to the Sims picture to add a Sim. You know, when you're making a uh, household, you're creating new Sims, just hit that plus. And then it brings up a little menu and it has like a little DNA little picture and you can play with genetics and you can literally create parents, siblings, child, uh, children, um, 
and pets. So that's what I did. I made her a little family. Because, you know, when you create a sim, brand new sim, they don't have any family. So that's a way to get around that. Hi, Mom. Um, Mom, I'm due any minute, and you might have to clean up my amniotic fluid if I go into labor here. And do you have anything to eat? Because I'm kind of hungry, so let's... Of course you have no food, Mom. Okay, let's just grab a quick meal. I think she won't she won't trip if I do that, right? Because, um... Because my mom. I mean, we have a good enough relationship, so she shouldn't say, Don't do that, that's inappropriate. Like, this is my childhood home, okay? I can make a ham and cheese sandwich. I can make a ham sandwich. It is so dark in these EA homes. Ugh, I can't stand it. Although, I do like that. Um, I like this tile. Oh, good. She didn't trip. Yay. What else can we do here that she's not going to trip off of? What else is here? Okay, see, I guess this was like her childhood room and her brother's room. In their parents' room. Perfect. Well, the house ended up working out perfectly. Because we're randomly throwing Sims in it. It's cute. Maybe we'll give it a makeover. Probably not. Probably just dump the whole thing. Where is everyone, Mom? <laughs> like, where is... Is he at school? And Dad's at work? Because Dad doesn't even have a job. He's unemployed. Where is Dad at? <laughs> I know Brother is at school. He should be, anyways. Mom, do you have any parenting tips for me? Why are you crying? Oh. They always cry when they watch these cartoons. Shrek. It's not sad. Shrek isn't sad. Mom, I need some parenting trip tips. Oh, let's joke about old times. She's never going to have this baby. Oh my goodness. Dudes about cats. Remember that cat I always told you I wanted, Mom? Well, guess what? I still don't have it. Let's get to know. Cause I think there's one more trait we have to discover. Tell an unbelievable story. Yeah, you won't believe this, Mom, but I'm about to have, like, at least 50 babies with 50 different men. Aren't you proud of me? <laughs> Her mom's like, are you... What? <laughs> what did you just say? Like, are you serious right now? Honey, I don't think that's a good idea. I'm just gonna... <laughs> just gonna admit, I don't think that's the wisest idea you ever come up with. Is there no, re no way to talk about fertility? No. Okay, why not? I thought there was an option to ask for parenting advice, but I guess not. I guess once you reach your parenting max. From what Stacy can understand, it seems like Erica just finished her period. That means she'll be ovulating soon. <laughs> oh my god. Is that what asking about fertility is? Oh, okay. That was a little invasive. <laughs> that was a little um personal. Excuse me. I swear I made a house kind of like this. Like in one of my first... Let's plays with the bathroom like under the stairs like that. That's weird. That's reminiscent. Girl, are you lazy? You didn't even put your plate away? Gosh. We'll just throw it away. No, let's put it into the sink. Where's the sink? So rude, Stacy. Okay, Bob, well, you're boring. And you can't help. I thought maybe. Can I take a nap here, Mom? Do you mind? Thanks. I'm, I'm sure you don't. Let's just take a quick nap. I thought you were going to be able to, like, give me parenting tips or something. Oh, my goodness. It is literally so boring at the first of a Let's Play. Usually, like, my Sims turn up a little bit more than this, but... Huh. Uh, I guess not today. Who's this? Should, should maybe, um... Is she pregnant? No, she's got a fat belly right now. A fat belly and a fat booty. You know, I don't think I've ever been over here to fish. No, I don't really come over here that often, I don't think. Oh, there's some there's some good collectibles though. So her we take this nap. Take this nap and then we're gonna dig this one up. Let's go ahead and put on the mm, this one, the outdoors one. Curator. Yeah, we're gonna do that. And then I saw another one over here. Didn't I? Yeah, right here. You gotta dig a little deeper. Yes, that's what she's gonna do. And then we're gonna look for some more frogs and hopefully get another one. Oh, there's another uh, collectible. Um, is that enough of a nap? That's good. Get up. 
get up, get up, get up, get up. We got things to do. This baby is a coming and we need some more money. What's over here? Can she come over here? Oh, yeah. Is that where we just were? Is this the frog she's going to dig up? I don't remember. I don't think so. I know you're pregnant and everything, but you got to move it. <gasps> yes, finally. She's gone into labor. Yay. Yes. Okay, so let's go into the buggy hospital. So it takes forever to deliver these babies after she gets these uh, collectibles. What do you mean you can't get in there? Oh, because she's too uncomfortable. Oh, okay, that's right. Okay, so stop, stop. Stop, stop. We have to come back for this stuff. Just wait, stop, stop. Okay, so we are going to go and have this baby, finally. Good grief. Have the baby at the hospital, and we're going to join her. Who's baby's daddy? Oh, Marcus. <laughs> come on, Marcus. He's just probably going to dip out anyways, like they always do. Run like crazy and then leave. But we'll see. Maybe he'll surprise us and stick around. He's like, I didn't sign up for this. I didn't sign up for this. Marcus, we're having a baby. <laughs> I love that animation where they're like totally freaking out. Let's see. Let's see what she's having. Come on, hurry up. Come in here and take her take her heart out and squirt glue on her face. Like, let's let's get this done. Let's get her done. Who? Ooh, Tetsu. Do we so are we friends with you? Because um, yeah, we take you home. <laughs> and put you on the baby daddy list. Yep, there goes our heart. Put the heart back. Put the heart back. Thank you so much. Yep, squirt us with this glue. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's a boy. Yay. Taya. No, Myron. I'm at BJ Diego. Brendan. Ooh, I liked Adam. Let's do Adam. Oops. Okay, hello. A D A M. Let's do Adam Erickson. Is it twins? Yes! What did I say? I knew it. She was way too big to not. Josue? No, that's a mouthful. Finn again? Oh, we can do Finn. Yes, twins. What? Uh. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> yo, what? Come on. <laughs> no, 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 no. <sighs> See, <laughs> you know when things are just too good to be true. She wasn't big enough for triplets. Triplets? I don't think I've ever had triplets out the gate on this. Okay, the one last one wanted to be Josue. And he wanted to be Joaquin. Okay, I'm keeping Joaquin because I like this one. But, oh my gosh. Good thing that they can't have, like, quads. Are you serious? She has triplets. What are we going to do with triplets? Dang it, Marcus. Marcus. Why? Is she happy? She over here laughing. I'm so sorry if I just, like, screamed in your in your headphones, but... I don't know what we're going to do with triplets. I was prepared for twins. Yo, we got one bassinet. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, see, this is what I get for saying that the, the gameplay was kind of boring and kind of lackluster for the time being. And saying how things were going to speed up and get interesting soon enough but look at her body though like did her body get snatched yes it did the sis said triplets wear triplets wear she's got a little bit more of a dunk back there but look at her does she even know what she's in for like do you realize you just had tw triplets she don't know oh my gosh okay well we're gonna <laughs> We're going to end the episode here <laughs> and I'm going to try not to lose my mind, but yeah, it looks like the, 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 uh, let's play is about to pick up significantly. We're going to have triplet newborns and then we're going to have three toddlers at once. 
Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thanks for hanging out with me. Um, the next episode, we will get her preg pregnant again because that is the challenge. And try not to lose our minds with triplet boys. Three boys. Oh, this is about to be fun. I'm excited. I know I sound, I'm just a little bit in shock right now, but I'm excited. I don't think I've had triplets um, in my household in like over a year. So this is going to be great. But anyways, thanks for coming along with me and hanging out again. Looking again. for the ray of light. Bye. Life can be beautiful. Life can be beautiful. Going all the way tonight. Making it beautiful. Acting like there's no tomorrow. Acting like there's no tomorrow. Acting like there's no tomorrow.